Not gonna lie, totally had this plan. I was gonna get back to Austin from a two week vacation. I was gonna get all this cleaned up, the haircut and the beard trim. None of that happened. <laughs> no. I'm showing up Aloha AF. <laughs> I'm just like, what's up? Like, <laughs> making a bow and arrow? Let's go, buddy. I wish that you were wearing like an open Hawaiian shirt with a really hairy gut, and you're like, just got back from paradise. <laughs> let's, let's try it some. Making a bow out of PVC. So there are a lot of different methods online of how to make a PVC bow. People have opinions on the internet. Who knew? Yeah, we're gonna get a lot of them below. That's fine. Just, you know, just say, you guys are great. You can do that too. At first I walked in here thinking, we're gonna do recurve. Then I got intimidated by the curviness. <laughs> Look, we have a lot of room to grow, but we want to start with the simplest, most basic PVC bow and arrow, right? Yeah. So that would be the, what, the English longbow style? Yeah, we're gonna do that. We've got some five foot long PVC here. It's one inch. It doesn't seem like it'll bend much, but we, you we'll gotta it heat it up a little bit. We're gonna get to that. Okay. I was waiting for you to just snap it I, over I your knee. I seriously thought about doing that. <laughs> so we're gonna make a little uh, rigging, I guess you could say, a little heat trap so we can heat this up and make it flexible. Got it? All right, what wait, are we doing? Hang on, hang, wait, hang, hang on. on. Slow down! Sorry, <laughs> I don't know what to do. We're, I'm trying to explain it okay, to go. you. <laughs> you put it like this, Okay. right? Yeah. Because we're, we're just gonna put it right here, and so it's just kind of soaking up the heat and making a little oven, a little convection oven right here. Okay. That's all, yeah. that's all. I don't know if it's more effective. I just saw it online, yeah, so no, it's no, no, probably it's, true. It's, it's probably, if it's online, it's true. It's just, if it's online, just, it's just true. Just watch the show. <laughs> One thing doing this show, figured out that everything online People talking out their butts. Nobody knows. Nobody, Nobody knows, knows anything. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Including us. Especially. We're going to measure two feet from the end, and I'm going to mark it with uh, this little Sharpie here. Yeah. So that we know about so, where to flatten and bend. Got it. So this part will be the straight part. Everything else will be kind of bent. Uh, yeah. That's the idea. Did I do that wrong? Yeah. No. Uh, it, it looks Is that two right. feet? I think, yeah. Two that's feet. two feet. Two feet. Okay. Two feet, yeah, that's the middle. Heat it up. Yeah. We're going to flatten this in a taper. You know, flatten it in a taper where it, it starts off circular here and then just gets progressively flatter. Got it. So it seems like we want to start from the outside and work our way in because this can be more tube-like, but we want it flat by the end. Exactly. Right? Okay. And we're going to have to make sure that we do this simpatico to where the flat ends match. Yeah. Like, we <laughs> we don't want one of them like this and one of them like this, right? Yeah, sure, 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 sure. <laughs> oh, well, I was thinking we just use the our gloved hands and just kind of press yeah, down on yeah, if it. If it's hot enough to melt when you press, you don't want to use your hands. Well, it's hands. just getting bendable. If yeah. it starts melting or bubbling, uh, see, no, that's too much. That's, what, what do you mean it's too much? Yeah, it's starting to bubble. Just because it's stuff. burning? Right. Yeah. Well, here, ho hold it steady. Okay, here, let me get it, like, in this little... That's probably too much. Okay, there we go. Here, I'm gonna, I'll... There you go. Fortunately, we have a backup. Theoretically, you should just be able to push it down. Oh, look at this. Hold on, watch. See? Yeah. Not like that? Yeah. That's what you want? You don't want it bubbling or blackening, though, because, again, that will harm the integrity of the pipe. Oh, that's right, because you don't want it snapping and splintering. Exactly. And all We're going to have to wear eye protection when we use this. Oh, that's a good call. Oh, Here's okay. where Brant says, no, seriously, wear eye protection. All right. Here, feel, feel that. You can feel it bending underneath you. Oh, yeah. Right. See, the thing is, PVC wants to remain round, right? Yeah. Let's disabuse it of that notion. Yeah. So I guess you kind of want to hold it down while it cools as well, because otherwise it sort of kind of goes back to its round shape. How bad do you think the uh, chemicals we're inhaling are? There we go. Do we want it to be flat all the way down, or? Uh, it's supposed to taper. Because uh, it's circular, 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 and then suddenly goes bam, Oh, flat, sure, flat, sure. Right? Okay. So here, I'll hold this down. You go ahead and warm up this next bit. I'll make this flat two hand spans, because we're just going to kind of eyeball this, right? Yeah. There were a lot of videos that chose to, like, measure everything. <laughs> I know. That sounds right? like a show that's not our show. <laughs> that's not the modern road <laughs> way. <laughs> all right, here we go. So, oh yeah, there it is. Oh, so it gets soft really quickly. Yeah, it does. Here, I'm gonna oh, get- Oh, there's something I wish I hadn't said. <laughs> Man, that actually, not bad. That might be enough, I, is I it? wonder. I don't know. I mean, what are we gonna get out of making that longer? More bendy? We can always make it more bendy, right? But we can't bring it back to circular. Okay, yeah. Yeah. Confucius said that. Hmm. I uh, must have missed that one. I mean, I assume. 
We can always make it more bendy. <laughs> the Tao of Brian. <laughs> okay. Yeah, there you go. Okay, so once it starts to brown at the edges, it's like a cooking show. Yeah, it's like yeah. a toasted to a golden brown, and then it'll get flexible. I'm gonna bet this is the kind of thing that if you have the ability to let it go overnight, then it'll be stronger. Warm it up, uh, put it in a vise on both sides, let it cure overnight, get super solid or something. Oh, okay. Ooh, it's a little warm. All right, so it's really hot right now. Okay. So I keep having to, but I assume we want to keep it flattened while it cools. Is that side cool, you think? Uh, it's warm, but it's I think it's cool enough. So what's the next step we're doing? Do we need to give it some overall curve? Or do we want to look it up? What? Okay. Yeah, you're right, that's <laughs> stupid. <laughs> yeah, let's try giving it a little bit of a curve. Just okay. heat up the whole thing and just bend it ever so slightly. Well, so here, grab the vise. Thank goodness it's not attached to anything. Otherwise, we couldn't do that. Yeah. Let's do this side first. Oh, you want to do one at a yeah, time, a little curve? Right? Rather than like one just kind of yeah. gradual parentheses? Here, you hold that side. Okay. And I guess let's push both sides down. Oh, yeah. Yeah, there you go, right? Yeah, good call. Man, I, I am so terrified of this thing snapping. We're going to have to wear eye protection just looking at it. I think so. Here, take a look. You can see it's barely bending here, but it's really bending down here. Okay. So you kind of want to do the same thing. There you go. The general shape, feeling pretty good about it. Yeah. It's not quite even, but I'm going to say good enough, right? Sure. Here, let's take a look. You know me. Right? That's, yeah. That's kind of a thing. It looks like a bow. Yeah. Okay, good. All right, now what? Do you want to, do you want to give it a, a, a grip? You want to like See if you can heat it up and squeeze it and squeeze a grip into the handle? Uh, no. I no? do want to cover it in duct tape, though. No. Okay. In the middle. Uh, yes. Grab I'm that. I'm going to hold it. You tape. Oh, there you go. Well, I was going to have you spin it. Oh, okay. So, here, I'll kind of go downward. There you go. Keep rotating. There you go. There you go. There you go. There you go. Keep going. Keep going. Nice. Are we going to paint it? We can. Probably should have done that first. Soon it will be painted with the blood of our enemies. <laughs> you hit somebody and you run up to their corpse and you just rub blood all over your bow. You're like, it's better. And you're like, Grocknar, it's not better. You're like, no, it totally looks better now. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Blood of the enemies. You're like, you're weird, Grocknar. We cool. He's had some issues, man. That whole eczema thing really got him all twerked up. <laughs> twerked up? He's shaking his head at everyone. <laughs> He's, He's like, I have eczema, so let me twerk for you. He's really <laughs> proud of his twerking. God, well, why, would the why are you always judging Grocknar for his dance choices? <laughs> he says, hold on, Grocknar needs to go toot it up. <laughs> He's like, I Instagram this. <laughs> hold rock this direction. <laughs> get, get good sight. <laughs> Grocknar twerk. <laughs> Grocknar like to hunt. Grocknar like to eat. Grocknar like to shake his ass to trap music. <laughs> Grocknar watching Miley Cyrus Instagram. <laughs> True talent, rarely recognized. Grocknar come to modern rogue like wrecking ball. <laughs> yeah, right. good, yeah, good, right. good. Do you want to paint it? I don't know. What do we got? Here's some black. Do, uh, Here's sure. Some black. Yeah. I guess. Yeah. I'm here staring at it. Like, what color is it? <laughs> oh, it's the lid. You moron. <laughs> what you got? We got white. Yep. A couple of stone textures from our stone textures. Fake stone episode. Oh, then we could act like it's a it's made from bone. And that's what Grokner would do. Hazard orange. Let's do the stone texture. I want oh, it to look like okay. bone. This is we're using the good table. There's a good table? Yeah. <laughs> Always use uh, spray paint in a well ventilated area. That kind of works. Are you using aluminum foil as masking tape? Yeah. It's <laughs> I thought it was rather inventive. Actual masking tape a few steps away. <laughs> we can add more later, but that's at least a bone-like finish. Okay. Mark. Now we are going to cut notches into the tips for our bowstring. Okay, so there's a knot on this end, you pull it down, and there's a knot on the other end. Yeah. There's just one string. Yes. How far down you want to do? Uh, let's do like an inch. An inch? I th yeah, I think in an inch. Okay, here. Uh, just on the sides? Boop, boop. 
There you go. I'm just gonna. Oh wait, wait. Well, uh, you and I uh, <laughs> have different thoughts about this. Okay, we got a notch here and a notch here. Yeah. And then we tie the bowyer's knot. You tie it. It off. loops okay. around. For some reason, I was thinking you would do a notch like vertically and have a knot here and a knot down there. But, I got gotcha. you. But I trust you more than me. A variety of different ways, but most of them coming in at the well, side here, let's, there. Let's bring this guy back. Oh, in Oh, good call. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <sighs> Hold on. This is really useful because I imagine what the comments are saying, and they're almost always saying smarter things than we we would do. So. They, I think the imaginary comments in my head are saying, do it like this. Yep. You got that started. Mm -hmm. And now we want it big enough that we can fit the string in there. Grab this guy. Yep. And just widen that beast. We like that? I like it. All right. Looks pretty good to me. Same deal on the other side. Yep. This is not the appropriate way to use a file. No sh Okay, good. Let's do the other end. It's fine. Go back first. There you go. That starts the groove. And then, in fact, go back a few times so you have a groove. There you go. Yeah. There you go. Get this. I'm gonna file off the serial numbers. That way it can't be traced. That's what I'm saying. Uh, I think I ruined this. Right on. It's looking very bow-like. I mean, right? For having zero experience or knowledge, I feel like we're on the right track. It's kind of our ethos. Now what? Here I have 56 inches of recurve bowstring. I don't know how this is gonna work. We're gonna need to learn how to do a bowyer's knot. <laughs> this will go well. What the hell is this? It's recurve bow. I'm, oh. Oh, it's already yeah. knotted and everything. Oh. Thing. Is that too? I don't think. I don't Our know if this is, is gonna enough. work. Yeah, here, uh, stretch it all the way out. Oh, you know what? Maybe. But how are we gonna get it <laughs> around here? I don't think it's meant to go on this. No. This is a great moment to point out for anyone who thinks we have a script. If we had a script. <laughs> yeah. Who wrote this? <laughs> Was it you? <laughs> Did you write this? This is terrible. We yeah. can just make this small enough that it works, I think. Oh, Saw yeah. Saw upwards and make it so that fits on. Make, uh, taper the tip yeah. to make it yeah, pointed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I did see uh, people doing that, so. Okay, well, so. This part here, right above the notch, is still gonna have to be about that wide to keep it from slipping off, right? Or I don't know why it would slip off if it's, if it's tight. Yeah. It's always gonna be pulling down, right? It won't be. Yeah, these are already looped and everything. I didn't think that was gonna be the case. Yeah, there you go. Yeah? That goes on like that? You tell me that uh, you tell me that won't work? I just don't have a good feeling about it. But that's okay. I'm still on board. I'm ready to continue with this yeah, endeavor. Yeah, no, we got this. This yeah? is gonna be great. It's gonna be great. Alright. These were 15 bucks each. Oh boy. Right? So you remember when I got in trouble for dry firing that bow and arrow? I'm gonna hurt myself or the ring's gonna go flying, but I guess not, huh? We'll try it a couple. Of oh jeez. I was there. Yeah. Yeah. That the, was really stupid. Uh, comments were filled with horrific tales of people who had like split their skin open. What? And they said, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Like people lose eyes in that situation and stuff. I was apparently dry firing, no joke. I was very surprised when you did that. Who, me? Mm. Well, it's because I'm dumb. I'm like a child wandering into a movie. I would say you're dumb, but sometimes you are like a child. <laughs> we can recognize our own. There. And I see people like, Doing this like they're gonna like thread it like through their pants. Yeah. And, like the way I don't. Yeah. There's no way that goes all the way around. Why is one side bigger than the other? I don't know. There's probably some sort of archery reason for that. Oh, maybe that's why that there are two different sides. Is one's the hard one to put on and the other is the easy one to put on. Ah. Also, something I just made up. This is the small side. Hold on. Maybe 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 we're good. Aha, there we go. That is on there. And then that's the wider one, right? Okay, here. Uh, I don't want this thing to snap and injure us. Aprons, gloves. Yeah, let's do the whole thing. It seems like it's gonna snap. Do we I need don't to, know. Well, do we need to heat it up and give it more a little bit more bend? I don't know. That's how it's supposed to be, right? Let's put it in the vise. We need an so, adult. It's a good thing I painted it first. Yeah, yeah, you know. So I could heat off all the paint. Should do a TV show called Bad Builders. 
<laughs> where we just show up, whatever the job is, yes. we'll just show up and figure it out. <laughs> yes. Where it's this like is a job for, for humanity. Bad builders. <laughs> All right, let's see if this bends any easier. So I'm going to tighten this up. Yeah, yeah maybe that's a good call. Like wallets. Here, you get that side. Want me to bend it towards you? Yeah. Oh, 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 whoa, whoa, whoa. It's really bending. Wow. Oh, it's working. Whoa, I didn't expect that. Oh, ah, ah, ah. sit tight. Hold on. Oh, my God. We're geniuses. That's just what I was thinking. Bad builders. <laughs> almost, almost, almost. Almost. Come on. Almost. Almost. Yeah. Yeah. Holy. Did we make a bow? We made a bow. Sort of. That's not good. Well, that's real bad. That's bad. Do you want to heat it and like? You want to heat it right now while the string is? Uh, no. No. Here. Is that bad? Uh, I don't know. It's not great. It's not the best. Let's heat that side. Yeah. Let's do it. <laughs> <laughs> What was that? <laughs> like salacious crumb? <laughs> All right. Oh, oh, that's soft. Well, that explains a little bit. Here, I'll kind of hold this up a little bit. I'm going to wait for it to cool down. Okay. Because I think, I think while it was hot, we got it too bendied. Ooh. And almost certainly, we're reducing the structural integrity of this thing. Yep. I feel like that's going to work. Okay. Ooh, it's still hot. Still hot. Yeah, 125, 130. Okay, so we'll let this cool. At least it's even at this point. It's almost as though I've never done this before. Oh, I got it. Holy shit, holy shit. Did we make a bow? We made a bow! We made a bow! Yes! End of episode! That's like not drinking the Pruno, man. We can't do that. <laughs> For a first effort, it looks pretty good. So we're gonna pull this tight. Yeah. Do we want to redo it again with more notchiness in there so it doesn't slip off? Because I'm afraid if we pull Ooh. it back too far, yeah. that could just slide right off. Yep, yep, yep. We're going to go ahead and cut a little bit deeper of a notch in there just to make sure our bowstring doesn't slip out. Yeah. I'm going to go ahead and not put my wrist beneath the hacksaw. Well, you know, to each <laughs> their own. Here, we'll tighten this up. I already did this once, so we just need the... Yeah. Same game on the other side. All right. Try it again? Yeah. Okay. Yeah? Okay. Nice, nice. Oh, that feels right. Right? Yeah. Okay, do we have arrows? Do we have a target? <laughs> we have arrows. I will let you choose your target. Okay. Is it our new unnamed friend who bears a resemblance to BJ Blaskowitz? Yeah, it's gotta or be. Is it the change line? Oh no, it'll bounce right off that hard structure. I want the one that it'll stick into. Okay. I'm gonna try this darker stone. Okay. And then we'll give it a test. Yeah. What are we gonna name it? <laughs> Grocknar. <laughs> Grocknar? <laughs> yeah, it's a, a, a Grocknar's Revenge. In Diablo. Plus three to twerk. It. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Grocknar's Revenge, plus three to twerk. Oh. Feels pretty good. Right? Your ammunition, sir. Oh my gosh, this is legit. <gasps> yeah. What ho, Jason? An enemy approaches, blindfolded, and up against the wall. Are, are we doing an execution? I think we are. <laughs> it's Grocknar. Grocknar shall fall. He will not have his bow back. Yeah, we should be clear, this is, the dummy is playing the role of Grocknar. That's not his name. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Yeah. He shall henceforth be known as Dave. I'm worried about this thing just shattering when you pull it too tight. Well, I'm just gonna shoot just like a little lob. This is right. probably gonna go poorly. Yep, go, go, I'm ready. All right, um. Just gently. <laughs> uh, that worked better than I expected. Uh, Matt, yeah, me too, it's uh, wobbly. And that's probably just my own lack of archery skills, right? Uh, yeah, a little bit. There you go, yeah, yeah. Oh. It's a functional bow. At this point. Do you wanna try it? it? Uh, sure, here, here we go. You got it. Take him down. Oh, that, that felt was legit. Good. That yeah. Felt good. You just going full on trying to hit him? Yeah. Okay. Uh, it's it's tough, right? Yeah, we should learn archery. 
I don't think that's an appropriate pose. It went far, though. It, it went did. very far. It did. All Going right, again? Yeah. I, Do I, it. I, I'm not going to hit him from here. I got to get closer. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> all right. All right. <laughs> I, I don't know how I feel about the fact that it bounced off his chest. I'm just going to put that to his muscular physique. Yeah, yeah, I think that's a win. I mean, that hit dead center, didn't it? Yeah, no, that's that's good, that's good. You're just going to keep scooching forward a little bit? Well, yeah, and I'll tell you what, I'm getting less and less worried about this shattering as, as I mess with it. Yeah. There's a reason they don't wear fencing masks when they do this. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Here, let me, let, me, let me try a couple. Yeah, 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 here, here. I'm realizing in order to get it to really fire, we put too much curve in this. Did we? Yeah, because it's not, you, you'll see it. Like you have to pull way, way far back in order to get a decent thwack out of it. Oh, you're not even using the gloves now. I don't think that's proper form. Nope. But it can't <laughs> hold it. Close, oh. close. Man, that elf lady in the Lord of the Rings movies makes this look way easier. <laughs> Tighter, tighter, tighter. Oh yeah, you got that, you got that. Oh, no, 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 you're gonna hit him. You're gonna hit him right square in the eyeballs. People are like, didn't the Hun teach you how to fire arrows? Yes, but that was a different type of shot. All right, one more. All right, you, all you right. gotta do this. All right, all right. This one's for all the marbles, Murphy. Oh! Yeah! <laughs> yes! Oh my God, it really worked! Yes! All right, let's just see what else we got. Turn that sucker into Boromir. <laughs> Pierced by many arrows. <laughs> oh. Oh. Center mass. Ah, oh. you know what? Give me one of those gloves. I think there's a reason yeah? people have those things on their hands. Oh. Yeah, I can already feel my fingers getting numb. Damn. Oh. Okay, so I seem to be falling to the right a bit. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> He's right. a tough son of a. All right, go for it. From hell's heart, strike at thee. Yeah! What? <laughs> I'm telling you, man, you got to pull it really tight. We shouldn't have voted quite so much, so to speak. All right. That was dead center, though. What was that? Uh, I don't know. It looked like it slipped off. Yeah. Oh, that was good. Oh, man. That would have been a great one. Oh, come on. Okay. <laughs> womp, womp. Well, so, so here's what's happened. Even as it's flying, you can tell that we want to have more tension on there because it's kind of going sideways yeah. as, it, as it hits and bounces. Man, that one's in there, in there, though. Man, I say, I say let's just get right up on him. Get right up on him? Straight to the center of their heart. <laughs> Full extension. Yes. Show no mercy. Oh, I see. You're coming for us? That's why you're blindfolded? You think we're so weak you can take us blindfolded? What are you, uh, what are you, some kind of a uh, revenge uh, guy from death row? Well, yeah, do we have words for you? Because we got Grachnar's revenge. Grachnar's revenge. This is the revenge. For crimes against fashion, we sentence you, Taco Pizza Cat and Grachnar, to doom. Oh, okay. Wow. <laughs> 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 it seemed like you were kind of down angled. Yeah? Okay. Yeah. I didn't think about the arrow bouncing back and hitting us. Uh, it occurred to me. You got it. You got it. You got it. Right on. Yeah! <laughs> oh, so good. All right, here. Hit him good. again. Hit him again. I'm going to go for the head. No way. Yeah, no way. <laughs> no way is accurate. I'm telling you, dude, don't mess with that dude's head. He's got a hard noggin. Whoa. Uh, oh, hey. Did it get you? How bad? Uh, no blood. No blood. I don't ha -ha. know if that counts as the injury ha -ha. counter. Ha ha ha. You guys got all excited, didn't you? <laughs> oh. Is the blood? Oh, reset the counter! Reset the counter! <laughs>
Tiny, tiny little pinprick. <laughs> All right, let me try. Let me you're try up, once. You're up. Yeah. <laughs> this is so dumb. <laughs> We're so dumb. All right, here we go. Here we go. Oh, I hit wow. that telephone pole. That was amazing. Oh, that was almost really good. All right, here we go. Oh, Ooh, that was quite the ricochet. That's scary. Yeah, that was a little nerve wracking. All right, I think this will be the last one no matter what. <laughs> I think he's got more attempts on us than we have. I on think him. so. For not knowing what we were doing, we got shockingly close yeah. to something really good here. I yeah. think we put too much bow in the bow. Yep. And as a result, it doesn't pull as tight as we would like. Yep. But and, uh, also, uh, maybe don't shoot somebody who's made of really firm rubber. Yeah. Or don't shoot anybody. I mean, we still got him. We got him. Shot to the heart. And you, boy, you, you got hit twice? No, 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 that's just. You're definitely bleeding. Oh yeah, I'm definitely bleeding. Yeah, that's a good day. Oh yeah, no, I got hit twice. Roll it back. Somehow. Roll it back. Know. Roll it back. Yep. Uh, 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 it wasn't Brian. Uh, 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 magic hands, Brian. Uh, uh. <laughs> I felt pretty good, you should try it. Yeah? Yeah. How did? How does this work? No, no, that's not how, this is how it begins. It's less comfortable not, than I okay. remember. <laughs> this is, all right, give me, give me, give me. <laughs> Look, you remember that we fell in love with Hollow Pillow, man. Oh God, the do buckwheat I. pillow that is nice and heavy and it air cools, it's filled with buckwheat, doesn't get hot on one side or the other. This is gonna sound like hyperbole, but it changed my life. When they said, hey, we want you to try our pillow, we're like, we'll be the judge of these pillows. Yes. They sent them to us and then we did an ad where we're like, yeah, we seriously love these pillows. Yeah. They're like. Could, could you have shown the pillows? Oh yeah, we were supposed to do that. <laughs> well, no, 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 I, I mean, but, but they, they, they had my face grease all over it. I don't want to show that pillow. <laughs> Here's the important thing. Oh, you totally do. Like, okay. <laughs> they sent us another one, partly because my wife stole mine. I've not what? seen my hollow pillow in a month. What? Okay, so this is a pillow that's filled with buckwheat, but it's these tiny little seeds and it just, it's perfect. It just shapes to the your pill to the shape of your head. Uh, I, that was terrible. I <laughs> know you're doing great. Okay. Now these were actually widely used in Japan and still are. And oh my God, it is. And we have a T-shirt, which is fantastic. All right, here, get rid of this. Get rid of it. You know that thing when you're sleeping and you're doing, you're flipping it. Yeah. And like, Never. Do you want to know? A funny I never thing? touch it. <laughs> I remember a sniglet from when I was in third grade. Nobody but me knows what that is. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna only speak to you. Go ahead. There was a sniglet called Blivet, which is the process of turning over your pillow constantly to finding the cool side. I love it. That's perfect. <laughs> That's perfect. No bliveting. Yeah. I wear those in-ear uh, noise-canceling earbuds to shut out the outside world and then fall asleep listening to yeah. an audiobook. It hurts on a regular pillow for it's squished up against the ear. But I mentioned this before. But you just you just karate chop a groove and then your head goes on there and then boom no painsies no judo no krav maga specifically karate <laughs> right here by the way if you're somebody who wants less material you, you just, can adjust it you just take take it take out here I, i'm, I'm gonna out. open it. i'm gonna open it usually i sleep on uh, the skulls of my enemies but i have made the transition to hollow <laughs> now it's the husks of your enemies crops that you harvested <laughs> yes yes <laughs> there it is here it is here it is here it is you got to be gentle you got to be gentle Look at that. Are you ready to look into the face of God? Oh, there's the good stuff right there. Mm. Oh. And see, that looks like it would be super uncomfortable. It's so... But it's not. I, I, I'm going to put my hands in. <laughs> okay. That's so good. All right. Only open it if you plan to adjust the amount of buckwheat yeah. that you have. Not if you just want to dip your hands into it like you're Juan Valdez. <laughs> uh, Another <laughs> reference that no one knows. Hey. Sniglets and Juan Valdez. <laughs> Where's the beef, Brian? I think I saw this pillow on. That's incredible. <laughs> All right, special deal. Go to holopillow.com slash rogue. That's R-O-G-U-E. Sign up, and not only do you get a 60-day free trial, sleep on it for 60 days, then send it back. Say, sorry, I, I don't like it. You won't. I'm, I'm weird. You won't. It won't happen. But if you get multiple pillows, you can get up to $20 off. Best pillow I've ever owned, hands down. It really changed the way I sleep and uh, changed how I felt the next day. I also like the way it sounds when your head's on it and you hear that crackling, it's like white noise. It's kind of like you're next to the ocean. It's great.
If you listen closely, you can hear the view count of the modern rogue. Hush, little baby, don't say oh, a word. Is that a subscriber? Oh, it's Jason's beautiful. gonna buy you oh. a hollow pillow. <laughs> no, he won't. He never does this. I can't think of anything that rhymes with pillow. Oh, so what are you gonna say then? But that's okay, because you already made it really weird. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Come here. Did it hit an embed? It embedded. What? Yeah. Holy sh! Holy sh! It broke and embedded. I'm gonna just leave that there. That's a testament to the power of this thing.